We are most encouraged about the results seen in chronic myelomonocytic leukemia. This is a blood cancer that has overlapping features of myelodysplastic syndromes and myelofibrosis. And it's a very unique malignancy because the bone marrow in these patients, uh, they have clusters of cells called as plasma cytoid dendritic nodules, which are very brightly positive for CD123, which is targeted by the drug. And so we expect that these patients should have a better response. We're also developing certain biomarkers based on flow cytometry and are really excited to see how the expansion cohort does. This is, you know, for patients who have usually failed uh, therapy with a hypermethylating agent in case of CMML or a JAK inhibitor in case of myelofibrosis. And so they're largely transfusion dependent, they have uh, constitutional symptoms, uh, and they also have increased risk for transformation to acute leukemia. And so the hope is that we improve their blood counts, reduce transfusion dependence, improve constitutional symptoms, and actually produce uh, improvement in terms of responses, overall response and complete responses.